Welcome back to CBS News at 5. I'm Paul Mason. And I'm Pat Harvey. A former bank assistant manager gets nine years in prison for robbing her own branch. Aurora Barrera claimed she was kidnapped by strangers who strapped a bomb to her, but the bomb was fake. CBS 2's Dave Lopez was at her sentencing. This is Aurora Barrera on September 5, 2012, sitting in a sheriff's squad car. She had just told detectives that she was forced to wear a pipe bomb around her body while two suspects robbed the B of A branch in East LA, where she was the assistant manager, robbed the bank of more than $557,000. It was all a lie. Miss Barrera was in on it, along with her boyfriend, Ray Vega. $8,200 was actually recovered. Uh, it was turned in by one of the uh, co-conspirators. And then we have a rough estimation of how much was spent by two of the other co-conspirators. But uh, how much was spent? Uh, about $150,000. On what? Uh, they spent it on personal expenses and, um, you know, frankly, narcotics and uh, bars and, you know, living, living the high life. Before giving Ms. Barrera a nine-year sentence in federal prison, federal judge Manuel Real lashed out at her, asking her, quote, where's the money? Where did all the money go? You've done nothing but lie to this court. Is there any way that this could be in some overseas account under a fictitious name? and it's just waiting for them after they do their time? Well, again, we continue to look for the money, and I, I won't speculate as to where it is. The judge asked Ms. Barrera if she had anything to say. She answered no. According to the evidence, Ms. Barrera helped her boyfriend and the two other accomplices load up the bags of money from the bank vault into their getaway car, and the evidence showed that she showed them where the $100 bills were in those bags, sitting on the shelf, untouched, with the bags full of money that contained the ones and the fives. Just the large bills were taken. And the judge told Ms. Barrera this, quote, Mr. Vega did a good job of helping you ruin your own life. From downtown Los Angeles, Dave Lopez, CBS 2 News.